Okay, we wanted to go over the larger contact tank fittings today. Uh, these are for the 48 gallon and up contact tanks. So the 16 inch, 21 inch, and 24 inch tanks. You can get these with a two inch fitting, an inch and a half fitting, or a one inch fitting. On all of the larger contact tanks, the water enters at the bottom and exits at the top. So your water would enter through this bottom fitting, exit through the out on your in and out head, similarly for the other sizes. The other side of your in out head is where you would put a vacuum breaker and or just a plug. For the one inch size in this, the bottom uses a clack in and out fitting, which has a, it's able to swivel, it's a swivel fitting. And that contact in there is made by an O-ring. So it's a little strange because it's when you tighten this nut all the way against the stops, it still allows it to swivel and there's just a little bit of deflection there. That's normal. The seal is made inside there with the O-ring. On all of these fittings, uh, we send with silicone lube, uh, which is for the O-rings, and that'll make the O-rings last longer and seal better. And since the water on all these is entering at the bottom, the main fitting configuration you want down there is water in, water going into the bottom of the tank, and on the other side of this T you just want a ball valve, uh, plastic or stainless, and that allows you to flush the tank out. In normal operation this ball valve would be closed. When you want to flush the tank, you open up this ball valve and release the oxidized material that's been building up in your tank.